you know, we got some, we got something good out of this today. Okay. The Richard Wolf conversation was wonderful. It was brilliant. I loved it. Uh, on top of the Richard Wolf conversation though, uh, earlier in the morning, I posted this shit. Okay. Straight up thirst trapping for all of you. I'm trying to do my very best out here in spite of all the circumstances and, and give you some, some good, some good content. Okay. From a bygone era, uh, the the mullet comes back to life. Um, didn't realize that like there was a long history of like uh, thirst trapping with blood and knives and shit. I thought that that was like uh, like I, I didn't realize. I'm not I'm not familiar with it. But of course, even that in and of itself, what the fuck is this? What that is is uh, the cover for the next King Kong magazine. Okay, you can go and like it here as well if you want. That's the cover for the next King Kong magazine. King Kong magazine is like some high art, you know, crazy, crazy magazine that does like, uh, you know, weird and, and, and oftentimes disturbing photo shoots and shit like that. Um... I obviously didn't pick this. They were the ones who wanted to do this. Uh, and I was like, sure, let's do it. Let's 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 do something different. You know, I'm down. Every time I've done anything with magazines, I've gotten like endlessly fucking yelled at and made fun of. Uh, but I thought maybe this will be a little sexier. Um, the issue was already fucking sold out. The website crashed. This is not the model. This is Lydia Wren, who is actually the photographer. She's the one who came up with the concept. She's the one who actually did the photo shoot. And she was taking this photo herself. Anyway. So. Did they pay for the photo shoot? No. I'm taking the pages with me when we get drafted. Insta comments canceling you for violence against women. Really? Oh, is this in hot or sexy? It's gross and normalizing violence against women. Well, Haley, well, you know, as a man, I didn't think it was my place to tell a, you know, an Asian woman what direction she should take for her, uh, you know, photographic endeavors. Okay. How does it feel to be on the same cover as Blady, Drain Gang, and 100 Gex? Pretty good. But yeah, I I also knew that it was going to be like that. I knew that it was going to be like, uh, you know, people were going to get mad at it. It's supposed to be like uh, edgy, I guess. But I didn't realize that people would get mad at it because it wasn't edgy enough. Um, That's right. One of the things that I did not know, I, I didn't really like think it through beyond, uh, is there an interview? I think so. Obviously the majority of, obviously the, the majority of people that looked at it in this community, they loved it, whatever. Right. But there was also other standums that got involved in this, not realizing that like, not realizing that like other standums, uh, have also like, they basically, no, no, no. They weren't even saying uh, normalizing murder. What they were... What they were mad about is that they said that, like, this wasn't edgy enough or that, like, their own celebrities have done a better job. Like, this is what I mean. Look, here, immediately, as soon as, like, QRT, it, it like, shows up. You know what I mean? It's like... Like, there are... Apparently, this is, like, a common theme. leave photo shoots for girls you should be building a chair or dying in a war like people took this like people basically took this like as an affront to their own favorite celebrity that has done this so i think i like lit up i think i basically lit up like every single standum all the fucking nazis all the swerfs who are like you're a man you should die you should kill yourself um 
And and people that are like, yeah, look, okay, who's going to tell them looking hot while being covered in blood only works for women? Like people thought that I was uh people thought that I was like shitting on women with this by being like I'm taking away like this is exclusive to women. A lot of like, oh my god, this is so corny. Uh, look at the loser. He's such a dork. Think about the preparation and thought put into this loser knife blood. And yeah, he's like 30 years old, by the way. It's so weird. It's like, I think one of the worst things you can do, one of the worst things you can do is like a content creator, I think is basically, uh, try like do anything that's out of the usual. If you do that, blood king fandoms getting mad at you for using their aesthetic for views. Yeah. Like people, people fucking lost their shit, but Hey, I did it for you guys here. You know, I did it for Hostwit. I did it for my own, my own, uh, you know, community. So, yeah, if you didn't like it, well, maybe it's not for you. You know what I mean? Mrs. Meow Mom owning you. How he just keeps getting more tarded, says Mrs. Meow Mom. Why are you reading the troll comments? I. It's just the reason why I was, um, the reason why I was showing you this for a second is that like. None of this ultimately matters. And that uh, uh, Twitter is just uh, a, a, a shit fest of the, the absolute most mentally ill people uh, competing on a, on a mental illness off. And uh, whoever fantasizes about the absolute worst hypothetical that you have engaged in uh, will, I guess, win the mental illness off, basically. I really should have never shown anything. That what what actually fucking frustrates me? What actually fucking frustrates me is uh like not not this shit, but what literally pisses me off is my own fucking community being like, dog, like I know your tire blew out, but it's like literally your fault. You're a fucking idiot. Like stop driving. Like it's just so fucking it, it's so frustrating. Auntie is being gay with it. So you think violence against this bussy is a cute aesthetic for a photo shoot? What are you doing with that shovel? Burying the bussy you just brutally assaulted and murdered? Okay. Call trolling? How do you get baited by it every time? Well, you know, I, I just... I get baited by it every time because, like, my goal is to fucking have a back and forth conversation so I take everyone seriously. It's It happens, you know? It is what it is. Okay. So... Oh my God, bro. This, this fucking guy ever. Look at this. Look, look. How does it feel to be on the same cover as Blady Drain Gang? hundred guys. You said Blady wrong. You pronounced Blady wrong. You pronounced Blady wrong. You better pronounce how to, you better learn how to pronounce Blady correctly. If you want another group mad, you better learn how to pronounce Blady correctly. If you want another group upset at you. This has been the the uh, parasocialist hour. We'll get a lot of uh, we'll get a lot of usage out of these photos, in my opinion. So I hope you guys appreciate it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, you know, I I put I did the worst thing you possibly could do, uh, which is post uh, post as you're trying uh, to a group of individuals who like don't understand the background of how any of this stuff works. But ultimately, I'm very excited. I'm excited because this is going to be a good week regardless, all things considered. Uh, you know, Tarek's coming over. Um, but if you are wondering, uh, I did not have a say in the creative process of this photo shoot. I simply just went there. Um, I just went there and shot. That's it. Most people hating are dumbass who think you uh, you put the shoot together on your own and they want to gatekeep blood shoots. Mostly just people that need to bury themselves in grass. Yeah.